Hey guys, how are you doing? My name is Sharon. Okay, so let's get going. I think pop-ups are extremely important for any website. Let's just take a look at what the options are here. So here are, um, go to here, we'll take a look at my website that I designed the pop-up for. But if, no matter what industry you are, you could have something that you can give away for free that you can collect emails from. So what are some of the things like I, I talk about online presence. So here's my free guide grow, grow your online presence. And what I like about this is that it, um, it's a mock-up. It's three dimensional and it's very easy to create. They give you a template. You can design this any way you want by changing the text, by changing the color. I like pinks so that, you know, I, and I really do try to keep a lot of white space. So I try to do that. Let's take a look at some of the things as far as the, um, the mock-up. In this program too, there's a mock-up that you could do. So there's lots of different ways to make like a three-dimensional image and I strongly encourage it. Rather than just a plain image, you know, you have the option of, is it like a mobile app that you're designing? So you would want to put it on the phone. Are you doing a report? If you're doing a report, then maybe something like this with, you know, your image that you can design in Canva or however you want to do it. Um, so there's lots of things that you can do and it grabs the attention rather than just saying sign up for my newsletter. So I think that's really important. As far as the overall setup for it goes, it's not that bad by any means. It's um, in here are our website, like the different pages. So usually the pop-up is going to be on the first page, the home page, right? So all you have to do is basically hit um, add a pop-up. You could go through the different types of templates that they have and all of these can be changed. Colors, images, um, very easy to move around. And then as far as the setup of it, it has to do with the, um, we'll take a look at that. Let me just I'll cancel that out. your online presence and then we can just configure it and usually when you're configuring the website it has to do with timing most of the time it's going to be a few seconds you can do it as soon as they come onto the website I have mine set at five I can go down a little to three um, the other thing is like if they're already scrolling at the bottom these are the different ways to set it up you know if somebody is leaving if um, you're scrolling all the way down to the bottom or if you just start to scroll. Those are different ways that you can start that pop up from just, you know, popping up. So I strongly encourage it. I think it's one of the best things that you can do for your business from day one and it's never too late to start it if you haven't already started collecting emails because three years from now, five years from now, you're still going to have those emails, that collection, providing you're giving good information, you're not spamming, and, you know, they're your target art audience. That's the bottom line. People come back, they sell, they'll, you know, always the word of mouth. So you want to keep in contact with um, people. And honestly, emails are, are the best thing. We know that social media platforms come and go, but emails are, are definitely around to stay. So um, do, do collect that. I hope that this uh, video has been somewhat helpful for you. Give me a thumbs up, okay, if you like it. And also subscribe to my channel. I do tips as far as increasing your online presence and what I think you should be doing. Next, next video, we'll talk about different industries and perhaps ideas for um, doing different opt-ins. All right, take, a, take care and have a great day. Bye, guys.